roller coasters come in all shapes and sizes, ranging from small kids' coasters that are for the littlest of thrill seekers to intermediate family rides, all the way up to some of the largest roller coasters in the world. Now, everybody watching this video is here for one reason and one reason alone to learn about the 10 tallest roller coasters on Earth. Now, my source for this video is going to be RCDB or the Roller Coaster Database, as after all my research, I found it to be the most reliable source online that I could find. Anyways, let's dive straight into the list. Starting off our list as the 10th tallest roller coaster in the entire world, we have Orion at Kings Island in the United States of America with a max height of 287 feet. Built in 2020 by Bolliger and Mabillard, despite this coaster's 287 foot height, it is still technically classified as a Giga Coaster, one of just seven in the world, due to its 300 foot drop that actually dives in a trench to achieve that length. This coaster may not have any crazy visuals or have a super long twisted layout like some of the other coasters on this list, however for the ride that Orion gives you, it is certainly exhilarating and is sure to leave everybody who gets off of it satisfied. Moving on to the ninth tallest roller coaster in the world, while staying stateside, we have Intimidator 305 at King's Dominion, with a max height of, as you guessed it, 305 feet. Manufactured by Intimate Amusement Rides in 2010, this coaster is known for being one of the most intense roller coasters in the world, pulling some crazy positive g-forces throughout the entire layout. This coaster is not for the faint of heart, however, as despite its max speed of over 90 miles an hour, this coaster spends most of its layout hugging the ground, sending you through tight turns and small hills, all while blazing through its red track, all the way until you hit the final brake run. Moving on to the 8th tallest roller coaster in the entire world, we move on to Leviathan at Canada's Wonderland with a max height of 306 feet. Built by Bolliger and Mabillard in 2012, this coaster is only one foot taller than the past ride I mentioned Intimidator 305, however its layout is completely different. Also being classified as a Giga Coaster, this ride has a long layout that features a lot of long turns and high arching airtime hills that make it very different from other coasters on this list, however it's certainly a crowd pleaser and is also the tallest roller coaster in all of Canada. Quickly heading back down to the United States of America, for the 7th tallest roller coaster in the entire world, we have Millennium Force at Cedar Point with a max height of 310 feet. This coaster, despite being one of the oldest roller coasters on this entire list, being over 20 years old, has really stood the test of time, with an awesome long layout filled with bank turns and a couple large airtime hills, and despite being over 20 years old and having a ton of consistent operations, this ride is still buttery smooth, making it one of my personal favorite roller coaster experiences. This coaster also has some pretty amazing history behind it, and you can personally thank Millennium Force for some of the taller roller coasters on this list that we'll get to later in the video. Heading all the way across the globe to check out the 6th tallest roller coaster in the entire world, we have Steel Dragon 2000 at Nagashima Spa Land in Japan with a max height of 318 feet. This coaster, as you can tell by the name, also opened in the year 2000, however it opened a couple months after Millennium Force, so unfortunately it could not be crowned as the world's first giga coaster. The coolest thing about this ride, in my opinion, I haven't even mentioned yet. This is actually the world's longest roller coaster with a track length well over 8,000 feet. This coaster just goes on forever, and it's actually astounding how long this coaster is, given the fact that it goes over 90 miles an hour, making it one of the coolest roller coaster experiences in the entire world. Starting off the top 5 on this list, we have Fury 325 at Carowinds in the United States with a max height of, as you guessed by the name, 325 feet. Opening in 2015, this was, and still to this day, is the tallest roller coaster in the world with a lift hill, meaning everything placed higher than it on this list will be launched. Apart from that fun fact, this is often regarded as one of the best roller coasters in the world by most roller coaster enthusiasts, praising it for its airtime packed super long ride that is visually stunning from off ride and might just be the longest coaster experience on this list. And coming from somebody who's ridden this coaster about a dozen times, this thing really does not disappoint. Sliding into the fourth place spot on this video, we also have the first launch coaster described so far on this list, Red Force at Ferrari Land in Spain with a max height of 367 feet. This is actually Europe's tallest roller coaster opening in 2017, shattering the old record by a pretty hefty margin. 
Apart from this coaster's awesome fact of shattering the European coaster height record, it also has some pretty fantastic theming to one of the best car brands in the entire world with a giant Ferrari logo slapped to the side of this ride support structure and a bunch of cars in the ride's queue and around the structure. And despite obviously not looking like a Ferrari, it certainly does accelerate like one. Starting off the top three of this list, we have the first coaster to ever break the 400 foot height barrier. Superman escaped from Krypton at Six Flags Magic Mountain in the United States with a max height of 415 feet. This might be the most unique coaster on this list as this is actually two individual coasters. Neither of these rides is a complete circuit as you launch either forwards or backwards out of the station depending on what side you pick and you launch all the way up your tower and then drop back down. Many people criticized this ride when it first opened for being incredibly gimmicky, and while that may be true, it is still one of the tallest coasters in the world and certainly a spectacle to look at from off-ride, and from experience I can tell you this is one fun ride whether you believe it's a gimmick or not. Moving into the top two, we have Top Thrill Dragster, or now Top Thrill 2, at Cedar Point in the United States with a max height of 420 feet. This coaster opened in 2003 as Top Thrill Dragster and would operate exactly that way up until 2021 when following a major accident it would close for a major refurbishment where the name would be changed to Top Thrill 2, a multi-pass launch would be added as well as a vertical spike and the coaster would be extended by over a minute. Now because of this, this is one of the most unique strata coasters in the world and that defines a roller coaster over 400 feet tall. So what's at the top of the list? What is the world's tallest roller coaster? Ladies and gentlemen, it is King Dakka at Six Flags Great Adventure in the United States with a max height of 456 feet. After opening in 2006, this ride has held this record without problem as no coaster ever since then really has even attempted to come close. There isn't much I can say about King Dakka without sounding like a broken record as it really does have a similar layout to Red Force and Top Thrill Dragster already mentioned on this list, but this is a once in a lifetime roller coaster experience I can't recommend enough to anybody watching this video. Anyways, thank you guys for watching this video of me counting down the 10 tallest roller coasters in the entire world. Let me know how many of these you've ridden in the comments down below. Me personally, I've ridden 7. If you did enjoy this video, feel free to leave a like rating and subscribe for more videos just like this every single week as it really does help out the channel. I'm Hangtime Thrills and I'll catch you guys next time.